brain tech here where tech is made simple. Just a quick video to highlight a change that Microsoft has started to make in Outlook and Outlook on the web um, in case you do use Outlook and um, that is that they are now starting to um, move the apps um, like mail, calendar, people to do and so on to the left hand side of, uh, of Outlook to a new side panel and side bar. Now previously um, the apps were located here at the bottom of the uh, folders list and now Microsoft has started to make this change more widely available which has been in a, in a test phase for some users um, to try out uh, the new experience since March of this year 2022 um, but you did have up until now the option to opt out but now they have started to make this as they are calling it a new default experience where um, those apps are now moving from the folders list here at the bottom to the side bar here in Outlook now and Outlook on the web. Now according to Microsoft uh, in their announcement regarding this change and I'm quoting this they say this update will provide a consistent experience across Outlook, Teams and Office.com for switching apps and it creates room in the UR, the user interface for more apps to integrate with Outlook. So basically they're just trying to make the look um, more consistent between the apps. So if we go to um, Office.com yeah, you can see um, as many of you will, will know the apps are also placed in the left hand sidebar so um, Microsoft say with Outlook Office.com and also Teams just to mention some examples they are trying to just unify the whole experience and then they also carry on to say you can easily easily launch popular apps like to do Yammer bookings Word Excel and PowerPoint without leaving the Outlook email client and um, they also say uh, you'll be able to pin the apps used frequently by right clicking on them and according to reports though um, this new change um, because once you um, this update does roll out and moves the apps uh, from the folders list to the sidebar um, uh, you cannot revert back there's no option to opt out like there previously was so this is causing a bit of controversy controversy because obviously outlook um, users are, want, are wanting that that um, option to be able to have the apps in the folders list or in the sidebar but microsoft has removed that so if and when it does start rolling out to you um i've already received the the update um you won't have any option to opt out so just want to let you know that that new change now with the apps moving to the sidebar and and side panel is now becoming more widely available so thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one